Today I want to test if a 3D printed X handle actually works. Before I'm diving deeper into the video and I will be finally testing this print, I want to go ahead before all of you in the comments will say, no, there are cheaper X handles out of wood. They cost only two bucks. Yes, that's actually true. I know that and usually I would buy one, but I just want to see if this will work and that's this, the whole purpose of this print so nothing more there's no no idea behind it that's not a great invention I just want to see will this work and now let's go printed out both of the pieces and I can tell you this is pretty heavy it's about 250 grams of solid plastic um, I don't really think that this will ever break but we will see as you can see this was my test piece printed in PLA with I'm not sure one parameter and 10% infill or something I was able to heat up the head and then smack um, this in. As you can see now that it's cooled down you cannot push it in again. Um, I just wanted to confirm that I can actually bring this plastic into the metal head. So what we are going to do now is unscrew the screws because I will reuse them for the grip. Then I'm gonna mix some 2K glue, clamp this together and glue it together and then I'm gonna screw in the screws and let it sit for I'm not sure one or two days until it's finally cured and after that we'll repeat the procedure which I tested before, heat up the head and then smack this into the head. I think this will work just fine. One eternity later. My initial plan didn't really work, so I had to place the handle in the clamp and then screw the screws in. So I will leave it sit like this for, as said, one or two days. Also with this clamp in the end and see if it actually is bonded together very good or not. It's now three days later. And we're just gonna check if it's solid, it's tough, and then insert the handle into the X head. So it is quite heavy on the tail end. And this here is a pretty solid piece of plastic. Uh, I think this will hold pretty well. Time to clean off the edges a little bit and then insert it into the X. This is the bottom side top and now we're gonna heat it up and see if it will fit.
seems ready. Now we will sharpen the blade and try to chop something. So this is the result of the short test and I'm absolutely on your side if you say no that's not a scientific test. Yes that's absolutely true. I just wanted to give it a go if it would actually work and how the feeling of the handle is. Is it sturdy or will the handle be wobbly inside of the head? No that's not the case. It's actually super freaking solid. Nothing is even moving in there. Um, I can only conclude that the plastic, because it has been molten a little bit by the heat of the head, has absolutely filled about any void in there and the additional glue and this little metal plate on top fixes the handle super tight in position. As said, this is not a scientific test, this is my, my impression, my first impression. I will use the hex in the future in my garden and uh, I will let you know via social media if in any day it will fail, I will post a picture, I will analyze it. But so far I think it's comparable to a wood one. These also break it at some point. It definitely is way more expensive and it takes way more effort to insert the handle into the head. But as said in the beginning, I want to test it out and I think it's an okay, a decent result. Uh, it was pretty fun making this and testing this out. Also the size is quite cool. It's this little small X. I'm wondering if I can actually throw this X. Maybe? Maybe in the next video or not. I don't know. Yeah! And now at this point I want to thank today's sponsor which is you. Yes, you. If you give this video a like and comment on my stupid idea which I tend to make then you help me keep this channel running because you let the YouTube algorithm know that this video is interesting for you and you can of course also subscribe to my channel. Just push this button where it's written subscribe and ring the bell as I have heard from other creators in the community which is cool. So I hope you like this video as always. I want to thank you for watching, have a nice day and goodbye.